Zooming Western got off to a good start, but so did Aces and Ale. Both of these go on strongly. Fidel on the inside as a goody go. And trying to close in as a Vegas lady is Zooming Western on the outside. And a goody go down along the inside. Zooming Western to win it. And now returning to the winner's circle is number six, Zooming Western. It's owned by Jaime Casillas. Our congratulations going out to trainer Vaude Ferris, settling his first quarter horse winner here at Los Alamitos. Winning jockey is Jonathan Roman. Well, we have a 19-year-old jockey on fire here at Los Alamitos Racecourse. We're talking about Jonathan Roman. A couple of weeks ago, he won his first thoroughbred race. Then right after that, he won his first quarter horse race. Now you're back in the winner's circle, this time with Vaude Ferris. You just gave him his first ever quarter horse win, and now you won three races here at Los Alamitos. How does it feel to get in the winner's circle so many times already in your own career? career? Well, it feels really good, you know, we're making our dreams come true. We're, we're going to keep on riding hard and never give up. We're going to keep on giving our 110% all the time, and that's how it's always going to be. Now, you started out basically as a fan. Your dad used to own horses here at Los Alamitos, mm -hmm. so you used to come out and root for your dad's horses yeah. to win races here at Los Al. Uh, was that something that just got your juices going and led yeah. you to becoming a jockey? Yeah, like, I always wanted to, you know, be in this winning circle and give it, and it feels good to be out here. And riding, we're always trying to give our best to get another picture. How did you get started? What was the first step to be actually becoming a jock? Uh, well, like I'm telling you, it was been in my blood. I always been wanting to ride, and I told my dad I just uh, like since I was little, I always wanted to ride, and he told me, All right, if that's what you want to do, well, we're gonna give you a chance. And I started galloping horses in the ranch. You know, people used to pony for them because I wasn't strong enough to hold them myself, and we kept on trying and never gave up. And here we are. Now you're just 19 years old, mm -hmm. and you just started really riding professionally for what, a couple of months? Yeah, yeah. we were up in the fairgrounds riding mules and quarter horses, and we came here and decided to get our apprentice license and just started riding thoroughbreds, and people are giving us chances to ride quarter horses, and we're going to keep on giving our best. What's the rush of riding a horse? Tell somebody that like me, you know, too big to ride, tell us what's that like? Yeah, well, I don't really feel a rush. I've, I'm already used to it. Like, I feel used to it. It's just that it's just I always get right with my heart. I always ride with my heart and give it my best. And if I could, if I know I could do it, I'm gonna keep on riding hard. If not, I'm gonna just let let everything handle by itself. And the horse does basically all the job itself. And we've been working together. And I've been these horses. I've been getting to know them more and stuff. That's why I like to come out here and gallop them in the morning to get to know them better. What's the toughest part? Uh, competing against these jockeys here. They're pretty hard jockeys. They're top jockeys out here. And I think that's the toughest thing, you know, competing against them. It's a little bit more pressure because, you know, they have better horses than you. But that, that don't intimidate me. We're still going to keep on riding hard. Well, sounds good. A 19-year-old with a lot of confidence, already in the winner's circle three times, and expect to see him in the winner's circle many more times to come. Jonathan Roman here at Los Alamitos. Back to the studio.